Okay, how are we doing out there? First things first, my name is Kenneth Bird. My company is Crystal Edge Technology Screens. First things first, I'd like to thank all of you for all your support for supporting our Black Friday Cyber Monday sale that is going to be going on until December the 4th. Also, too, I'm enjoying the new setup down here. So, like I said, we're going to be still doing some work in this section right here. I'm going to be adding up to make it a little bit more nicer. But until then, uh, we have the uh, final uh, Phantom. This is our black, sorry, gunmetal black slate uh, screen technology screen paint. I've had a few people who've sent us emails asking us about projection screens. Uh, we do have screens, but those are season screens, the screens we paint only in the summertime. Um, those are the uh, acoustic. Uh, screens at a come in at 150 inches and the gamer screens that are around 178 those are the ones that come with the free LED lights we only spray those in the summertime because we do those outside right now it's kind of cold outside so it's not something we're going to be doing right now now as of today like I said right now on the website we just have screen paint products um, we do have now available on the website um, as a free color option, the new uh, Deep Red and the um, Gunmetal Black Slate, which you're seeing right now. This is actually the Phantom Gunmetal Black Slate 21. This is using our advanced ambient light projection technology. And as I said before, we call this the meter max out zone because meters don't pick up down here. Literally, there's so much light in this environment that the meter is just not registering. So I'll show you. I got my meter right here on the floor. We got it turned on. Just to show you that, here you go, that's the meter maxing out right there. It doesn't even pick up. I have to take my hand and cover it over top the sensor so you can see there's a reading. But the once I move it away, that's it. So we literally have that much light in this environment that the meters don't read down here. So we call this the meter max out zone. As I said before, as you can see, and look around the environment, we don't have any extra lights in here. Some demonstrations I've seen where they'll actually add extra lights in their demonstration to try to boost the um the um the readings on their meters but we don't do that as you can see no extra lights at all period and we're able to produce a beautiful image from corner to corner without the picture washing out or fading uh, maintaining a beautiful image the projector we're using in our demonstration is our um lw 401. This is our Christie projector. Keep in mind, it's at 4,000 lumens. We're around 12 feet away from the screen. Keep in mind, 4,000 lumens and an area at 12 feet away uh, with a projector, I mean, with a meter that's not even picking up because so much light. Um, there's not 4,000 lumens hitting the projector. Some people think if you start off with 4,000, you end with 4,000. No, that's not possible. Um, pretty much the more light you have in the environment, the more lumens you will lose. Now, keep in mind, we did do this demonstration on a thousand lumen projector. I will post that below showing you even at a thousand lumen, your screen can still pick up with a meter. It doesn't pick up in the environment because that much light is popping off in the environment. This has to be, I love this area right here the most now because I used to do these demonstrations upstairs in the theater room, but now I love doing them here because of the fact that just so much light down here on top of my screen. And these lights right here are work lights. These are industrial work lights. Now you see we're picking up a nice beautiful blue all the way across without any fading or washed out. And like I said, I saw demonstrations on a screen paint or a particular screen paint that was used on a very high powered short throw projector. And you could see where the color was just completely washed out. It just wasn't picking up the color properly. And those are and keep in mind, this is on a maybe 3000 $4,000 calibrated projector and still had some issues being able to pick up um, uh, color in contrast with that much light hitting the screen. And here we are down here with the maxed up meter and we can pick up an image with no problem whatsoever. And that's what you want. You want an ambient light rejection screen paint that is going to work not something that is not going to have you in the dark 24 7 because it's the only way it can maintain a proper picture so let me get some other videos on here get these deep blue for um i like doing the fish because fish go over that kind of really deep blue let's go over to um let me see other demonstrations let's do some here we got one right here Spectacular colors. Well, like I said, we're using a 720p projector. That's it. 
My projector was discontinued in 2014. Let's pick up, let me see. Just grabbing some demonstrations here. This is a Smile Direct Club aligner. There's a particular video I want to see. There we go. I yeah, said so we call this the meter max out zone because meters do not pick up down here. And like I said, if you're watching a demonstration where people are just adding extra lamps in the environment, lamps you usually don't see in the demonstration, that's cheating. Um, calibrated projectors, we consider that cheating because you're, you're automatically enhancing your projector uh, to look good. Keep in mind, like I said, you're going to have customers that are not going to have projectors that are not going to be calibrated. So you have to keep it fair. I love this environment. I love how we have so much light in here. I love it. Let's grab something else. This is what you call true ambient light rejection technology. As I said before, screens, our technology has the ability to pull up amazing images either inside or outside. I've done these demonstrations outside at around five and four o'clock in the evening. demonstration. Like I see from the demonstrations I've seen online, you have to admit this is the brightest environment I've ever seen a projection screen at. No ambient light controlled environments, no dark environments.
color stays nice and rich, no washout, no fade out. Anytime, anywhere access in the cloud. And I'm Let's see if we can get around this. Of all the big packages, oh, we don't want to do a documentary. There's a star feel. As I said before, our gunmetal technology uses something called contrast shifting technology that allows the screen to be the mimic contrast levels, even in an environment where the meters don't pick up.
All right, hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. I'd like to thank you all for taking the time to help come out and, and support our company. Um, as I said before, we're going to be having our sale until December the 4th. Thank you all for your time, and you get a chance to see what true, true technology looks like, true ambient light rejection technology looks like. And keep in mind, this is how much light that we have down here in the environment that meters are maxed out. All right, hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. Again, thank you for your time. And as always, we thank our Lord and Savior for blessing, it, blessing us with such amazing technology. Thank you all. I have to go, and God bless.